Now, before continuing watching this video, if you have not watched part 1, please do so by clicking on the link in the description in order to understand the complete guide on how to register to become a GrabFood rider. In order to receive orders, you have to log into the GrabFood driver application by entering your email that you have registered with and the new password that you have reset. The great thing about GrabFood is that it's really flexible and you are able to select whichever timing you like to end. So now you have your GPS on, it's able to detect your nearest hotspot which is the fire or flame icon and the chances of receiving the orders are higher around this area. As you can see on the screen, there is now a notification that indicates the estimated distance that you have to travel from your current spot, a rough estimation on where the merchant is, which is the fork and spoon icon, and the customer's home, which is the home icon. I'm going to go ahead and accept the order, and what I really like about is that in the event, if you are in an area that you are not familiar with, Grab has provided a feature which allows to open up Google Maps and lead you to the merchant's address. Upon reaching the merchant, most of the time they would already have your orders ready, so your job is just to double check and make sure there are no items that are left out, as well as the utensils are already provided. And you'll be able to view the customer's address and once again using Google Maps to navigate and all you just gotta do is to deliver it to the customer. Once you have successfully handed over the food to the customer, swipe delivered and it will bring you back to the page whereby you will continue receiving orders and in the event if you do not wish to continue, just press the back button and proceed to end session. From here, you will be able to see your earnings on this session. Now, on the previous video, we mentioned aside from the GrabFood driver app, you have to download another app which is the Grab driver app in order to receive your payout. You have to connect to your Gmail account that you have registered with GrabFood. On the bottom of the screen, select the wallet icon, then select cash wallet. To view your previous trip records, select transaction history. To perform a cash out, select transfer to account and enter the amount that you would like to cash out. Do note that the minimum cash out is $50. Head back to transaction history and you should be able to see that your cash out is successful. Well for me, it only requires about 8 trips a day to be able to cash out $50. In the next video, we are going to discuss everyone's favorite subject, money.